How are you? I'm hanging in there. Hanging in there. It's got versicle. It's like playing cards. Green Bay. Seven of them. Ten. All right. How about ten? Okay. Go ahead and put these in here. Mm. Vans are cool. I think we've sold these a couple times. It's like 80s looking vans. Mm -hmm. Ten, ten, ten. Oh, these do have laces. Okay. Ten. All right. All right. Forty bucks. Thank you, sir. Y'all have a blessed day. You too. Absolutely. Easy peasy. This is our local flea market. My beautiful wife Haley and I come out here usually twice per week looking for cool things that we could buy and flip online. You guys just saw us pick up about $150 worth of shoes for only $40. So we're gonna see if we can find even more stuff. Good morning, fellas. Morning. Pool noodles. Use those for shipping. Here's what I mean when I say you can use pool noodles to ship something. This was like a framed art print that we sold a couple years ago. And we just like cut pool noodles in half and wrap them around the sides to cushion the edges a little bit. It works great. Highly recommend. What you got on the 20? Yeah, I'll do 20 on that. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. It's like a nurse's bag or something. Olympia, USA. Three bucks. Can't beat that. Did I already pay you for the drill? Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, I'll do I'll do five on that. Okay. Yeah. All right. We appreciate y'all. Thank you so much. I do five dollars. You get the game and the, and the console. I don't know if the console works, but the game mm -hmm. alone is worth that. Like it's missing the missing the screen. Let's deal with the paper game. Uh, uh yeah. Sure. That's not the actual game in there. Let's go Eevee's. What's in there? Let's go Eevee. Yeah. But even Let's Go Eevee's got the same price value. So. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good game. All right, one, two, three, four, five bucks on the Game Boy. Let's see if it works. Money back guarantee, right? Absolutely, always. I'm just kidding. What you want on the GameCube? I'm on uh, 65, it comes with a game in there and you get four controllers. Freedom Fighters, four controllers. Yeah, there's four games, there's two GameCube controllers and two aftermarkets. What you done broke my stuff? I broke it. All I did was push the button. I didn't mean to, I'm so sorry. <laughs> Now I feel bad. Sorry I broke your GameCube. <laughs> well, see you later. So this was one of our more awkward encounters at the flea market. I don't think I actually broke the GameCube. All I did was push the open button and it opened, but it wouldn't shut again as you guys saw in the video. So because I didn't actively break it, I didn't feel obligated like I should have to pay for it. But I'm definitely curious, what do you guys think? Did I break it? Should I have offered to buy it for $65? Drop a comment down below and let me know. Oh, it's dogs. These are fireplace things, the fire dogs, mm -hmm. but they're literally dogs. Which one on the dogs? 300? Well, see you later. How much are these? 75. And these? Those are cool color. 35? What size are they? Oh, they're big, too big for me. Yeah, women's 11. Is there any way you could do 100 for these and these? $10 off? Yeah? Okay. I'm 98% sure they're real. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. But we'll find out. There's an app called Check Check that we use to check the authenticity of shoes that we find at the flea market. So we went ahead and got these submitted, but we are waiting to hear back. I did hear a little rumor going around, the little grapevine here, that if you hit the like button on this YouTube video, it speeds up the checking process. I'm not sure if it's true or not. Could be false. I don't know. But we'll see. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. More hats over here. Tom, Tom, we should get that for Tom. <laughs> I don't see anything else except this North Face camo hat. Oh, that one's cool. UT. Mm. UI? UI? University of Indiana. Indiana. I got some yeah. uh, one more. vintage, maybe vintage, pop here, stuffed animals. A dollar a piece. Dollar a piece? Yeah. Nice one. Huh. 
Winnie the Pooh is a pumpkin. And it, and it works too. Huh. Sure. That one, that one works too. Oh, he talks? Yes. Yeah, we'll get the wagon. I'll fill it up. It's a dollar a piece. I like that. All right, so we got a hat. Whatever that is. Okay. And then two, two, so three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You know, you might have some good stuff sometimes, but... It's Georgia Beats. 14. 14. Oh, I'm going to find a painting or whatever. 15. Oh, Helga. Helga. Holy Lotus. 16. Bob <laughs> Builder. Oh yeah. Okay. He's a puppet. Eighteen, I think. Nineteen. <laughs> Twenty. Twenty-one. Might as well get that one. Twenty-two. <laughs> the whole bin. <laughs> whole bin. Thank you so much. Thank you. Gonna get this little motorcycle vest for Moe's. Yes. 100%. He's been wanting to join a biker gang. I think he's finally at the age where, you know, we can't control him forever. You gotta let him go and make his own decisions. All you can do is raise him right and then hope for the best. Okay. A lot of these are really, really cute, Josh. I don't know. Did you like see how many that were like actually vintage? Uh, like no, I'll Pinocchio? just grab them. The Pinocchio. Here? I just like Helga. I don't think she's Ooh. vintage. 2019, but. Still cool for a dollar. So Pinocchio is from '92, Mattel. Hmm. Yeah. That's pretty old. We're huh, 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 huh. supposed to make the hut hut noises. Oh, I'm so sorry. Another successful day at the flea market. I've got some news for you. We did hear back from Check Check on these Jordan One Seafoam Greens, and we sent them pictures of all the stitching and insoles and everything like that. And unfortunately, they said they are not authentic. Uh, we've actually sent them in twice to see if we can get a dis different person to give us a different opinion. And both times they came back as not authentic. Uh, they, both times they also said it was because of the inside tag. It's hard to show here, but I'll put a picture on the screen of the inside tag there. I don't know. I'm not a professional when it comes to sneakers like this, but they look good. They feel good. The quality materials and the stitching and the tag looks the same as other Jordan ones in this model that I could find online. So I don't know, check check is not 100% accurate all the time. I mean, they're really close, but sometimes they do authenticate fake shoes and sometimes they do not authenticate real shoes. So we may take these somewhere else to get a third opinion <laughs> technically. But uh, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you've enjoyed it, hit the like button down below. And if you haven't already, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below as well. Thank you guys again for watching, you're the best. We will catch you on the next one. Whew.